third in the front. Give him a little left tap. Let them know, hey, I'm right here. It's with the slower car. That was pretty cool. Nearing the one hour and forty five minute mark. The race. Finally in first, second right behind me. Sixty two laps in. So yeah, he's really close to me. Never mind, I'm kinda of pulling away. Yep. all gonna play a hand on when we pit. That's gonna time in the winner of this race. It's gonna be between me and that Porsche behind me. This is Ford. There. Starting to catch up. Okay, it's still right behind me. Almost 20 laps to go. Almost at the 20 to go, Mike. down my neck. When's he gonna pit? Ow. I 
mistakes were made. Um, not too long, especially with the, uh, car spins. Uh, I, I got a, um, I got a Bugatti, like, pretty quick off. Because I was pretty lucky on one of the car spins. But you can get some pretty good cars on the car spins. And, uh, if you're lucky, you can get, like, good payouts with the, like, the leveling up spins when you level up. So it shouldn't take, it wouldn't take too long. And, uh, I didn't. I didn't go online until I beat the career. Once I beat the career, then I started playing some online races. So, I, re I definitely recommend completely online, which, I mean, completely, uh, like, career mode, which doesn't take too long, and, uh, maybe completing some of the, uh, sh the, um, showcases. And then once you do that, then, um, online is... Would, you'd definitely be all set with online. I already have a bunch of uh, really good cars from like car spins and stuff. So. Yeah, I take the lead. Oh shit. Got a little loose. Lost it. Right now I have 8 million, and I've played all throughout career, and I've barely played any multiplayer, and I've bought a couple cars fully upgraded. So career probably got me around 10 million, so you can pretty much buy any car after you finish career. I don't know the exact, but I got quite a bit, because once I got to like level 50, then all the leveling up spins, like get you pretty high amounts of money and they stop get, giving you like cars for the main prize the main prize ends up being like a million dollars so you get quite a lot of money from finishing career and I got like a bunch of cars as well I got it, I think I got it in, I want to say January, and I finished it in February, so not many months, really. I did play it for quite a bit, like, so, shouldn't take, like, more than two months, maybe less than that, probably 
less than that, maybe one month. If you want to complete like the storyline, like the main career, that uh, you can complete that in like in like a month, less than a month. And you're welcome for answering the questions. But if you like want to go back and complete all the like all the series they can do, that might take a while because I haven't done that. I've only completed like one series through one volume. You're welcome. It's definitely a great game too. I really like Forza 6. Looks amazing. The physics are really good. A lot of nice cars. Quite a few good tracks. I mean, definitely my favorite was Forza 4. I might like this a little bit better. I'm not really sure, they're pretty equal. Uh oh, I'm out of fuel. Shit. Uh oh. Forza Horizon 2, I also like. I played a lot of Forza Horizon 2. I had to pit then. I made it to 68 though, but. Forza Horizon, well, actually I played Forza, the original Forza Horizon, I didn't play Horizon 2. Uh, I played Horizon 2 a couple times on, at GameStop, but I played Forza Horizon, like I almost complete. like I completed the campaign and everything, so, like the story of Forza Horizon, so, it was probably one of my favorite Forzas was Forza Horizon 2. I mean Forza Horizon, get, eh. Keep getting them too mis mixed up. Was, but Forza Horizon, the original, was the one might be. I want to get Horizon 2 for my uh, Xbox One. But. I don't know. I'm trying to decide between that and. Uh, what other. I don't know. Uh, I only, I actually, this is my real Twitch, but that's pretty funny. Um, but the name of it is my fake Twitch. Um, I, the uh, story behind the name was because my YouTube channel's name is Most Fake YouTube. And that started because my friend made me an email if I needed one for a school project. And we, he named it. He thought of the idea of me naming it uh, my fake email, and that all started the whole thing. So, Approaching the uh, two hour mark. Yeah. Um, I know, it's pretty much 
Exactly. It's like it's like the uh, Le Mans race, and because they do actually have a shorter version of the Le Mans race in like um, that I'm gonna be doing probably the last one because I'm doing the uh, endurance racing in the showcase. And uh, this is the uh, Daytona version of it, so, because, I'm going to be starting out, I, I'm going to be doing uh, all the endurance races, which are long races, so, I am pitting around every 16 laps, I, I tried to, but, but, a couple of times I got like uh, loose on the on the front stretch, so I decided to pit then. But about like I think I'm good for the rest of the race because I pitted on lap 68, I think. So. Damn it. Damn it. Okay. Well. No, I didn't mean that. Hold on. There, that's fine. I try not to use rewinds, but... Uh, I was going to turn them off, but I forgot. Yeah, I, I'm, I should be good for the rest of the race, hopefully. I know, but uh, I have the chat like right on my TV, right next to my race, so it usually doesn't mess up. But I just got un unlucky. <laughs> but yeah, as it, the race, I'm on lap 72, and uh, there's 84 laps left. I mean, there's 84 laps, so yeah, I've been streaming for two hours pretty much so hopefully I can last until the end my fuel I know my tires will be fine This is a mess. There we go. That was very sketchy. Um, <laughs> I don't know my internet speed. <laughs> I don't really know, to be honest. It, I think it's decent, I mean, I don't know, I'll have to ask. Oh, I just realized I lost my, uh, right brake lights. Whoops. Oh. I didn't realize that until now.
Damn, that's the wall. No, this is manual. I'm on manual. I'm on manual shift. See? I I just um, automatic in this game. It will shift like right then. The, um, what's it, the Abarth, the, like, or, like, the old Mini Cooper are, like, pretty hilarious cars. The limo, um, I saw a video on, on Xbox One that someone took that, um, they went around, um, what's it called, Lime Rock Park, I think? No. Uh, yeah, I think Lime Rock Park, but in the, uh, Cadillac limo. Under, uh, yeah. At, on, uh, Lime Rock Park. Alright, back to what I was saying. In Lime Rock Park, they, um, someone did the entire race backwards in the limo. Of course, it was an upgrade version, I believe, but they went around the entire track backwards in the limo while drifting the entire thing so you might have seen it but it's kind of crazy I wouldn't even make it like down the front straight away backwards but. Yeah, and on the shifting thing, I only do automatic in, like, the bowling ones, and maybe the autocross ones. No, not the bowling, the, uh, the, uh, autocross and passing, I think. The, um, the great races for that is the showcase races where they show off the, um, underdogs. There's... I know, Daytona is pretty great. Um, I'm... One of the days I want to go to Daytona for the Daytona 500, because that's always a fun show. But... Daytona is one of my favorite tracks. But yeah, the underdog races are pretty fun. Because you'll be racing like 20, there'll be 24 of the micro cars. Yeah. I, I live like all the way up in like northeast of the United, northeast US. So I'm in the same time zone, but I'm completely other, like completely north. So, I'm hoping, I'd love to go to Daytona. Be amazing, especially with all the new seats they added this year. They added 110,000 new seats.
Yeah, I, this was the most, one of my most used cars in Forza 4. I, I don't think so, because Forza's a Xbox One, a Microsoft owned, yeah, I know. <laughs> Forza's a Microsoft, uh, Forza is made by Turn 10, which is a Microsoft owned company, so that wouldn't happen. And they also they already have their uh, cheap version. I mean no hate, but I think Forza is better than Gran Turismo. But I mean everyone can have their opinion. Uh, you, you played Forza Horizon, like the Forza Horizon games. Because, uh, Forza Horizon's amazing. Like, for an open, like, it's an open world racing game. They're really good. Because they have the simulation of the Forza Motorsport series, and they have, like, the open world of the, um... Ah, oh, it is. I got I got it. Um, it was on sale at my local GameStop. I think it was like forty bucks instead of sixty or something like that. No, I think it was like thirty instead of sixty, and it was only on sale for that like that weekend because on Monday they were gonna put the price back. So I got it then, and it was like the last copy. So. I haven't seen second place since I last pitted. That also came with the, uh, the 10 years. Oh yeah, the, um, $40 on Amazon. I ha yeah. I like buying the uh, di disc version of games. I don't know. I like having the cases to be able to. But and uh, driving around in Forza Horizon is pretty fun. I, I sometimes I actually did that. Like I just drive around. Because they did a really, a really nice job on the scenery, too, and the map, so... But I did beat Forza Horizon. Um, I actually was one race away from beating it when I had to return it back to... Because I was borrowing it uh, from my stepbrother at the time. Because he got it with his Xbox 360 when he got his own one. But uh, I was borrowing it, and uh, I think it does have better graphics, especially the Xbox One version of Forza Horizon 2. But I think the uh, I mean I haven't played much of uh, Forza Horizon 2. I've only played the um, what's it called. The demo at GameStop, so that's about my knowledge of it as it goes. So, but I played a lot of the demo of it, <laughs> and same with Forza Five. I played a lot of that demo.
I've only played the, 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 Forza, the first Forza Horizon, and I've played Forza 1, 2, 4, and 6 of the Forza Motorsport series, but I don't really know. It's hard to tell. If you like simulation racing, then for the then for the motorsport would be better. But if you like open worlds, like need, like kind of like Need for Speed style racing, then uh, Forza Horizons for the, those kind of people. I like both for the most Forza and Need for Speed because I played Hot Pursuit a lot and Most Wanted. And quite a few other Forzas, and I mean quite a few, quite a few other Need for Speed games. But uh, I don't know. I prefer Forza over Need for Speed, but I don't know. I, it's hard to tell because they're two different kind of types of racing games. Because one's open world and one's uh, simulation. Yeah, it's only on the Xbox One. Gotta get the one for it. That's because it'd probably run at like 25 FPS on the 360 because it because of the graphics and everything, and it's such a huge game. So. They are making a Forza game for the window for Windows. That's pretty cool. Obviously, I don't have a strong enough computer to run, uh, like, Forza, like, high caliber racing games on it, so I wouldn't be able to play it, but... Because I, a while back, I played the NASCAR 15 demo on Steam. And it went, ran at like half speed on that, so. <laughs> I'm gonna be doing some uh, other Forza, like, after this, I can't remember what race I'm gonna be doing, but I know it's gonna be another endurance race, but it's definitely not gonna be as long as this one, so. But I am going to be doing some more endurance races on Forza. And I do live stream every single day. Because I live stream a lot of Halo 5 every day. Oh shit. Oh shit, well. Refresh it. Rewinding that. Oh my god, well. Uh. I uh, know there's only, um. Um, I don't think Charlotte. No. I would love, I would really love if they made like a NASCAR expansion where they'd add all the NASCAR tracks to it, which would be amazing. Because Turn 10 makes really good racing games, and it'd be awesome to see NASCAR on turn, on Forza and have like all the NASCAR tracks. They do have Watkins Glen for NASCAR tracks, and but I wish they had more like a lot more tracks. It'd be Really cool if they had like a lot more. Oh wow, two more laps to go. Almost done.
I know, I play I played a lot of the NASCAR expansion with Real Racing 3. I played that quite a bit. <laughs> it's really good. Final lap. Holy shit, almost done. But yeah, I Real Racing 3 is really I started playing it and then like a week after I started playing it, the NASCAR expansion came out for it and I was pretty happy because it's quite good for a mobile NASCAR game. Like, to be able to play NASCAR in mobile is pretty good. And it works really well. They did a good job with it. I don't even know where the second place is. Damn. Up, oh, there's a cord hitting into me. Going around the final turn of the race. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Let's see how much I get. Five. That's a lot of credits. Holy shit. <laughs> All right. That was crazy. Um, I'll do the. Don't worry. I may I managed to finish before I needed fuel. I didn't. I wasn't even paying attention to the fuel. I should have been. Oh man, that could have been really bad. But. We can go through the driver <laughs> spins. I actually drive a couple ra I actually drive a race car. Not like high like NASCAR up, but short tracks I do. But I've read Yeah, I know a lot of money. But I've I, at um the racetrack that I race at um oh jeez, mod buff achievement, sweet. Um, yeah, but the, um, it made it up to, yeah, I know, I would have been pretty bad. I already have the tip, so don't give me it. Well, I did anyway. I already have it, so give me the credits. Sweet. Wait, does that mean I got a million, 1.5 million, probably? Um, yeah, I would have been in trouble if I had one, if it was one more lap. But... I got. I did get a half a million because of the boost. The boost gave me half a million. Well, I mean, it gave me like I earned two two hundred fifty thousand from the race, and I got it. because of the boost that gave me like. Damn, I haven't got like a million yet. <laughs> but the boost made me get half a million. Let's see what do we get. Yeah, I got a million. Sweet. Alright. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> that was insane. Oh my god. Uh, yes, I, I... At the racetrack that I, that I race at, uh, every once in a while they'd have a, uh, like one of the, uh, the New Hampshire Motor Speedway race car. Uh, they'd have that, uh, at the uh, track, and they'd let everyone be able to ride in it. So, I have. So, let me just do my YouTube outro, and then I might uh, continue the stream going. But, uh, thank you guys all on YouTube for watching. Um, this is probably going to be three parts since it was two and a half hours long. So, yeah. <laughs> Thank you guys all for watching. Leave a like or a dislike if you to let me know if you enjoyed or di didn't enjoy, and subscribe to be able to see all my videos. I mean, well, you'd be able to see them without subscribing, but I tried subscribing, but it wouldn't let me. So you guys click it for me. But uh, 
I'll keep stream. I'm gonna keep streaming probably, but um. All right, sweet. Yeah, if you guys on Twitch want to follow, I'm gonna be doing some more fours and six now because I beat the career and. All right. Yeah, I might end the stream because it's kind of late actually. So. All right, everyone on Twitch, if you want to follow, you can. Yeah, I'm gonna be streaming a lot more fours and six. So. And I do stream every day, but most of the time I'm streaming Halo 5. Uh, sometimes I'm streaming Star's Battlefront or Forza 6 as well, so I'll be streaming Forza 6 a lot more when I have like two hours of time, so. Thank you guys for tuning in. Um, and thank everyone on YouTube for watching. And I'll see you all in the next stream and the next video. Goodbye, everybody.